Gorgeous curator here, and I just want to say happy new year's. Today is January 1st, 2020. So, when I was doing my videos, it was 2019. So, today is the first day. So, today I'm gonna do the art tour. So, basically, I paint. If you if you follow me on Instagram at painthub.com, you'll see that I do paint. I do post it not all the time, but I post it. You know, I'm selling my paintings right now. But now I just want to do a tour, maybe tell you a little bit how I got into painting. So basically, I'm going to be starting with my first. When I was doing paintings at first, which it wasn't on a camp canvas at all. It was actually on the back of like shoe boxes and all this ex extra stuff. But I first, I think I started sketching. So I was sketching in the sketching pad and it looks really nice. I want to give you guys a tour of that as well, but not on this video. It'll be a separate video. So today I'm going to get into the first thing I was doing when I first started painting because my mom bought me a painting brush and paint. So I was just basically like sketching and then outlining and then painting, doing something like that. This was on, oh, I didn't finish this, but I can show you this. So this was on a chip box. This basically, it's not painted at all. It's actually sketched. So it's actually a guitar. No, you can see it all the way, but I can show you good enough. Okay, so that was on my chip box. This, I think this was just like something I wanted to do. I'm not sure what this was on, but I know I did this did this and i really liked it this the thing about it is that i didn't put it on a canvas that way i could could have sold it but i can redo it it just says free free black and vote you know and then this part the, this was the pringles guy and excuse that right there but yeah the pringles guy and then i have the some of it might look weird, like the paint, because the paint, I don't know what what it is, but some of the paint just like, and I really was just like painting, like I wasn't really doing it for real, for real, so some of it might look a little up, but this is on the back of a Nike, Nike shoebox, so it's actually, um, I forgot his name, but he plays on Futurama, and he, all, he just drinks all the time, oh. So I actually liked it this one. I'm gonna redo this one. But this is on the back of a boot, a boot box. It wasn't a but yeah, it messed it messed up right here. But I'm gonna definitely redo this. It was supposed to be um the guy that always tries to kill Bart. And it was supposed to be his son. So it was really just like a baby. And I I did this. I liked it this part. But yeah, that was a long time ago. Then another one is this. This is on the back of a a piece of our box which is this i did this i painted him i forgot who he played on but it was a cartoon oh was it dumb dumb and dumber i think it was and i just added hair brown hair yeah then i had this which was the back of a nike nike box it was this it was supposed to be like a black chucky black chucky yeah, but I liked it at, at the time. I liked it. I was taking it to school and everything. This was on back of a Jordan box. And it was this. So it was Young Thug's album. I can't remember what album it was. Sad to say. But it was on the album. And I redid it because everyone made this whole announcement. He's about to perform at our school. You know, at the little pep, pep rallies. He wasn't. He didn't come, so it was on the back of a Jordan. I brought it because I, I didn't even have canvases back then, but yeah. So it was just a snake, but I redid it in my way. So this was on the back of, I guess, a cereal box. It was this, just probably like a stuffed animal that was stitched, not completely together. So yeah, that was it. 
And I did this. I'm guessing this is part of a box. I'm not sure. But it was, I always have this upside down. Excuse me. But this, I did this. Yeah. And as you can see, like, it's not really. I can show this because I know my paintings I'm doing now are very neat. But this, you see this? That means I was just playing around with it. I noticed. But I did this whole piece. This was on back of a chip box. Chip box. I did this by myself. I created this by myself. And I just, I just created. First, I got the little braids from Lil Yachty when he used to wear those beats. Well, he still, still does. Then I got the trash can. And, you know, it's just a more. So I did this. I liked this piece because I actually did this by myself. A lot of my pieces I do by myself, but you can see, like, where I got it from. And I'll tell you exactly where I got it from. I just did my own thing to it. I also did this to excuse this, but I did the on top, on the back of a Frosted Flakes. I painted this, excuse the cigar and the smoke, but I made him myself because I had envisioned that I was going to paint something like a man or something. So I was just like, hey. And most of my characters that you'll see me paint are black because why not? Why not? Why not get into painting black? No, so I think I did this on something. This is a box to something, so I just painted the hook. I really like this. I wish I want to put it on the canvas and I will in the future, but yeah, it's just like that. I was taking these to school, like, I was literally like taking all these to school. So, I'm showing them. so I got this. This is on the back of a box. I'm not sure what box, but this one. This is really nice. I really like this one. I, I love this color this color so i think when as i saw this color i just kept painting it just turned it cold okay so i also have this this came off of another boot box it was the I think this is clifford some dog yeah. i still watch cartoons but i don't know what that is might be clifford so this box. um Scribbles, the game. Uh, Bulldogs. I added money right here. You know, I took these. I'm gonna keep saying it. I took these to school. Like I was just trying to show off that I could paint. And I finally, I know I have like a lot of hobbies that I can do. I'm just getting there. It's supposed to be Tupac. Don't laugh. I don't want to hear nothing rude in the comments. But it came off of a senior box, and this is supposed to be Tupac. Excuse me for the mouth. Sorry, Dad. But yeah. I messed up his lips. It looks like lipstick. So it's supposed to be Tupac. It's called, it says Thug Life. I'm saying Tupac like it's written on here. No, this says Thug Life. So yeah. So now I can get into the ones that I actually did on a canvas. But like I said, I'm not going to show you every one of my paintings. Because I'm going to leave that to a part two. There's always going to be a part two of my paintings. Because I never stopped painting. At one point, at one point I stopped painting. And then now I'm painting even more. Like, I'm probably going to do a piece today, but I'm not going to show it right now. But I am going to do a video of where I create a whole piece. And you guys get to see exactly how I created, exactly where I got the idea from. If I did get the idea from something, then I'll show you. If I didn't, then you'll just see it. See me just paint, 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 paint. So now I'm going to show you the ones that I did do on my canvas. So, okay, as you can see, I'm going to tell you this once. If you do see, like, something wrong with my painting because of the paint, I don't know why my paint, sometimes I paint on a canvas, and then, like, days later or weeks later, my paint, my painting doesn't look the same as I, when I painted it the first time. So, I'm just trying to get into that, like, why is my paint, maybe because it's too hot in my room, maybe melting my paint or something, but this is one of them I did. It was a girl, a black woman flowers and a bird yeah that this was i don't think i got it from anything but i know the flowers and the bird i just added and i love this color so it's just like yeah okay okay i love this one this is egyptian i love this one i do i love really drawing like black 
women and men and boys and i'm gonna start doing portraits pretty soon so look out for those but this is a um a woman an egyptian she's darker has a dark complexion with earrings and if you see this kl i was supposed to it means creative lifestyle and sometimes i put it on my pictures because i was writing this on here but some of them don't have it because i did stop writing creative lifestyle on there uh, so this is supposed to be supposed to be in like i can't remember i've seen people with this like type of character and i'm thinking it may be from like chief keith or something but i really liked it so i painted, I painted it so yeah if you yeah painted this one then i gotta go and so this one i like this one i love this one when i started painting it i loved it so much but yeah this was one of my paintings uh i just did this recently maybe not weeks ago just painted her i love that one see most of my characters are black and when i start getting into the next okay next i have spider-man painted this one um yeah spider-man and this the funny thing about this part right here the blue or purple or whatever color you think you you see um it's actually from a pen this was paint and it's actually for from a pen i must have ran out of paint that time because i started doing it with a pen so yeah this is okay so i have a good artist like my favorite artist like looking into paint and spray painting because i used to spray paint like i used to spray paint but i couldn't get like monsters out of it but i will but um i used to look at chris brown a lot that's who i really got paints from and then when i looked at chris brown i noticed that he also spray painted and knew alec monopoly which is the guy that does like um richie 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 richies but the thing about the richie richies they're actually in um caucasian boy form so when i did the richie richies they are in black form so this is i can't remember what creature this was but if you know the creatures that i don't know just comment below let me know so when i do tell someone who i made i can say it so this was actually a zombie. I actually like this and it looks pretty good in color. See the blue is darker. Sometimes you'll see me with like paint of the background like this. Sometimes I do like it and sometimes I don't. But for this picture, I definitely do like this a lot. So. So. Another one is going to be this one. And it says matte money. Yep, I painted this one. Yep. I really didn't know how to paint. I knew how to sketch, but I didn't know how to paint. So me coming into this, I'm like, yeah. So this is a little Nas. When the song was really big, the little Nas song, I just painted it. So yeah. Like this, and it says little Nas. Okay, so painted this and it says what cloud is this and then as you can see it it is written creator and gorgeous all on the picture so yeah i incorporate i incorporated that into the picture so gorgeous creator Why not? okay so i did i think his name is sonic so i did paint him yeah now i love this piece but as i said the paint just whew, i love this piece look then i it's a, it's for in drip drip and then kl so i love this i love how he has the pony cell in the back and i love how i did two different skin tones because it is people it is people like with like certain skin like i'm gonna say certain skins because i love it either way so it doesn't really matter but this i painted this 
because it was on Chris Brown houses and you know in the media it said that his neighbors didn't like it so I'm like I love it let me put it on the canvas these are the thin canvases too so I loved it so I repainted it oh. this is a black woman yeah just thought I needed something. I'm going to start painting more of like, I want to get into portraits as I said before. I want to start painting people. I want to start having like bl a lot of black paintings. A lot of black paintings. Okay. So. I just painted something really cool. I think I was bored for something. So yeah, I just painted. It says goom goom so that's what it says okay i also have this side kids side kids side kids but yeah this was lisa yeah let's get that one okay i love this one i took this to school as well i was i think i was a show out i think i wanted to be a show out but i really like this one it's like a show out i did this piece so yeah I did this piece and we just have a few like I said I can't show you all of them right now but I wish I could and this is also not my room so the paintings that I do have down here I'm gonna show you okay do have another piece it's a woman I think I I, I should have did better on this one because I really like this. And plus I just added blue hair. Because I do. I want color in my hair. So why not put it on my paintings. It does say KL at the bottom. Okay. So. These are the last ones. And the thing I can tell you about these. These were just a few days ago. Like I. I painted this one yesterday. Let me see where I can put it. Painted this one yesterday. And I posted it on my Instagram. Well it's too. Never mind. This is actually, well, I can show you this one too. But I painted this one yesterday and I finished the painting. I started the day before yesterday and I didn't finish because I do have to study and all this extra. But it does say created and it does say not silenced. And it does have like African American hands on a jail bars. And it says, what does it say? We matter. It says we matter. And the reason I put this because they also say that it was made for us so i just said created it was created for us but at the end of the day it's not made for us at all it's not made for us at all no one should be put in jail and let i'm, I'm not gonna even get into that subject but i know some people that have harmed some people i feel like you, you deserved it but we matter and yes because it's spoken to me because my complexion is brown so i am a target so yeah, it spoke to me. Oh, this is a sketch. I did this a long time ago. I was supposed to put NBA Youngboy on it. I was supposed to paint a picture of him and like when I do get to meet him, cause you know, I am going to meet him. So yeah, I was supposed to give him that. So yeah, I did this um, two days ago, or three days ago. I just did this one because I just did this one. Um, I got this picture actually i didn't copy off anyone but i did get the idea of the face from um moby and rick i think that's rick and rick and moby the cartoon but it's actually a caucasian man i just do him you know brown skin with the afro and use the little pipe or whatever got the unibrow so yeah i just changed it up to for it to be my actual photo so i used some of the ideas from my head and put it on here so Okay, that's all I can say is this is the end of the video. I'm going to say Happy New Year's. And I'm wishing everyone a good New Year. I hope everything goes well. I hope everyone is successful. I hope everyone succeeds in life, get money, just do everything you want to do. So, yeah, that was the end of my part one of my art tour. I'm going to say art tour. Or creative lifestyle yeah this is my creative lifestyle that i just showed you and then we're gonna have a part two of my creative lifestyle so i'm gonna need you guys to tune in
get comfortable also comment i see a lot of people that just watch my video you can comment you can let me know you can let me know anything if i need to speak up if i need more lighting if you can give me ideas i am a new youtuber if you want to collab i'm looking for collabs i'm looking for people to be in my video so if you do want to be in my video hey comment below my instagram is painthub.com my twitter is creative loner no my I think it is. It's either Creative Owner or Medusa Made. And my my um Snapchat, I think, is Creative Loner. So if you guys don't know, it's Creative Loner. So I'm gonna need you guys to subscribe, leave a comment, and also, you know, comment below, thumbs up, and that's it. What was I gonna say? Scratch that. Comment and subscribe.